the basic protection for all healthcare workers exposed to the hazard of contracting the infection. So this is an inadequate measures. So with the SARS guard, we actually this uh, device will completely envelop the whole head and neck region, so that the whole head and neck region is being isolated uh, from contact with the patient's uh, droplets and splashes and aerosols. Frontline healthcare workers are always complaining that there are inadequate supply of personal protective equipment given to them to fight against the SARS, especially in the frontline units. Well, I feel that it is our duty as residents in Hong Kong uh, to participate in this fundraising project. Uh, after all, this disease knows no border and uh, affects all of us. In our study, there were 69 staff who adopted all four measures of hand washing of wearing gloves and gowns and of uh, putting on the right mask and none of them were infected. On the other hand, all 13 staff who were infected either were not wearing masks or were only wearing those two layered paper masks, which is not appropriate, you see. You see, the barrier, the barrier man is not designed for hospital use. It is more for field work. So they have a trousers, for instance, for better mobility.